Oh, bro, after all that big night binge watching, I need a refreshing drink, man. Someone give me something refreshing, bro. I really need one. Some prime would really work. Well, dun 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 dun. Arsenal Prime, baby. Taste test review. Yeah. Well, that really failed. Let's try that again. <laughs> yeah. All right. Enough with the skit. Let's get to trying this. This is from the UK. Very exciting. This is Prime Hydration Goldberry Mixed Berry Flavor. Never tried this Prime because we're in Canada. We get it from so sweet. Um, I'm weak. I can't open it with my hands. I gotta set the camera down. Ugh, cracked it open. It really smells like Meta Moon. This is what the color looks like. Switch that around a bit. Now, let's try it. You can see that this flavor sounds really good. Well, you can hear this flavor sound really good. So let's try it. Bro. That tastes like blue raspberry mixed with tropical punch. I don't really know how to explain it. That tastes kind of weird, but kind of good. The best flavor, in my opinion, is orange mango. I would give this third place after orange. I'd give this a 9.245 out of 10. Would I recommend it? Would I recommend that you spend so much money on it? This is literally like 15 Canadian for one bottle. No. I'm just doing a taste test. I have in my um, fridge, my handy dandy fridge, I have a, um, what's it called? I have a WWE bottle an Aaron Judd bottle, and a Erling Holland bottle. We will probably try the WWE after, but it's just Meta Moon, so it's not like it's that big of a deal. The Erling Holland is strawberry lemonade, but this Goldberry, not really impressed with the flavor that they mixed. I know it's mixed berry, but like tropical punch and blue raspberry mixed. Hmm. Haven't tried it before, so I really don't know. And the new bottle designs for the Prime have this little star inside, which I enjoy a bit. Never really had a UK bottle before besides KSI, which I have over there. I will go get it for you. Guys, I will now show you four bottles to compare. Well, um, these are... Well, I have five bottles, including the Goldberry Arsenal. These two are what we like to call the UK-shaped bottles. You can see that the KSI one's empty. Oh, it's good. It was orange mango, my favorite. Orange and mango, my bad. And then the Arsenal, which we all know, mixed berry, also known as mixed... Blue Raspberry and Tropical Punch. Now we will show an American bottle, which is also... The rest of these bottles are empty. And this bottle is L.A. Dodgers. The L.A. Dodgers bottle costed me $40 Canadian. This is Ice Pop flavored. Really nothing special ice pop fly that's what people call it but you know me i don't like to i don't really care what the flavor is it's just it just tastes good if it tastes good you got my money 
And these two are Canadian bottles. I will first show a normal, standard Canadian bottle, and then one with some American writing on the front, and the rest is just Canadian writing. So I got a regular ice pop, which is empty. And you can see that it says um, Suset Glacé on it. That means ice pop in French. Hydration drink and then boisson detente. And then it shows a brief description. Prime was developed to fill the void where great taste meets function with bold, thirst-quenching flavors to help you refresh. We're confident you'll love it as much as we do. Humbly, the Prime Team. And you can see 20 calories. The label over here. It says not intended for children, but you can only consume one per day. They um they no longer have that restricted rule on it. And now it's the moment you've all been waiting for. This is not a normal bottle. This is, well, it's a normal flavor, but it's a rare bottle in Canada. It was only available for two weeks. And this is Austin Matthews. Austin Matthews hit him with four like Austin Matthews. AM34, that's Austin Matthews' number. There's the Austin Matthews logo. Sorry if it's backwards, because, you know. And then Prime. It says the Prime logo right here. You know, the good stuff. So, out of these bottles, which one is your favorite? The UK... The U.S. or Canada. I prefer the U.K., honestly. Because these bottle designs just look cool. And it's harder for them to get dented because they're all in one blob of plastic. Compared to this one where you can just push and then it would make a dent. Same with the Canadian ones. Push makes a dent. But with the UK bottles, if you push, 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 you try to push your hardest, no dents will be made. And that's what I really like about the UK bottles. But my least favorite bottles are probably the American and Canadian ones. I prefer the mini bottles because they're more useful when you're doing other stuff. And you don't want... 500 milliliters of hydration and you want 355 I suggest that you don't go with prime energy because prime energy has a lot of caffeine and prime hydration doesn't have caffeine and lastly I would like to thank everybody for watching and supporting me on my channel and let's try to get to 5k subscribers thank you for watching and I hope you enjoy the next video.